the party is on in Winston-Salem. This morning, a new push to ban storming the court after this college basketball star was injured after the game. Kyle Filipowski is being helped off by members of the Duke staff. Unranked, Wake Forest pulled off an upset win at home against Duke Saturday, prompting dozens of fans to rush onto the court. One then collided with Duke center Kyle Filipowski. He was in visible pain as his teammates and coach ran to help him off the court. When are we going to ban court storming? Filipowski claims he was hit intentionally, saying he was even punched in the back. Both teams' coaches say something needs to be done. I don't like court stormings. They just don't feel safe. Just last month, a fan rushing the court collided with women's basketball star Caitlin Clark. She was helped off the court by security. Fans do not belong on the court. Uh, ever. Boo! Ever. And players don't belong in the stands. When somebody gets hurt, we're going to get serious about it. Serious injuries have resulted. Back in 2004, Joe Kay, a high school basketball star in Arizona, suffered a stroke and was partially paralyzed after being trampled by fans of his own team. In college basketball, some conferences already fine schools up to half a million dollars for rushing the court. Whether it's more fines or an outright ban, analysts say safety must be the priority. The Wake Forest administration dropped the ball. You have to have a plan in place. If you're playing this game and you, 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 you're expecting to win, you've got to hire extra security. You've got to have a plan in place to make sure these players get off the court safely. As for Phil Pawski, he reportedly suffered a knee injury. He posted on social media about court storming saying, quote, this got to change. Hi everyone, George Stephanopoulos here. Thanks for checking out the ABC News YouTube channel. If you'd like to get more videos, show highlights, and watch live event coverage, click on the right over here to subscribe to our channel. And don't forget to download the ABC News app for breaking news alerts. Thanks for watching.